Yeah, it's tender. <laughs> wow. <laughs> so we have Kyle here today. We also have Maverick. Uh, Maverick, what type of dog are you? It's a Pomeranian. It's a Pomeranian. <laughs> and, um, but Maverick's not getting adjusted. Just Kyle, what do you want to work on today? Uh, my neck, my yeah. upper back. I had a shoulder injury and surgery about four months ago. So okay. I'm just still working through that mm -hmm. neck wise and it affects my jaw and, and things. Okay. We have a very uh, dog friendly office. So people do bring their dogs a lot and it's just something we've always done for about 20 years. Um, so if you ever come in and you want to bring your dog, as long as your dog's semi-behaved, it works uh, here. So hand your dog off and we'll get started. And, um, but the left shoulder, is it, is it unstable or can we do yeah. stuff today? I mean, weight wise, it's a little unstable, but right. I mean, do you feel like they time. did a, They did a good job. Was it a successful? I do. Yeah. I do. Good. Yeah. So that's awesome. I'm going to have you lie face down. I want to check your hips first and make sure they're not kind of jacked up or anything. Here, pull back towards me just a little bit. And um, I'm gonna put these alignment shoes on you. They help us really see the difference between, um, you know, if one leg is pulling short compared to the other. And so the first thing I notice, besides these we're on too loose, is your right leg's pulling short. And I'm gonna bring it up to position two and they even. So Does some- sort of bother my lower back there. You, you felt it just bringing yeah. it up? So let's try that right now. Let's jump ahead. When I bring your legs up, point yeah. to where you feel it. Right here, it, I feel like it just like creases there. Is there one side worse than the other? Or is it just straight across? Pretty even. Even, he said, okay. So um, let's do something else. Take this whole leg, lift it high in the air, but do that by yourself. So start again and do it one more time. Do you feel it again in the same spot? I do. Okay. More, more on this side, I feel like I might be compensating on the left. So crosses over the left. Lift this one up. Do you still feel it on the left or did this one cross over? Uh, that one actually is still on the left too. Yeah, so the left feels like it's worse, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. Like if we start looking at it functionally. Um, okay, so then let's do the, go back to what I was about to do, which is I'm gonna balance the pelvis. So we know that the right leg is pulling short. I'm gonna push into the sits bone. That does make a difference. So let me make the adjustment now. And I'm gonna adjust into the sits bone, into the sacral tuberous ligament, into the glute. I go back to the legs, they're balanced. I'm just curious, I might pull a little on this one. It doesn't do anything, so nothing happened. That was just uh, a hunch of mine that did not pan out, but they're even in position two. When I bring it up, and we haven't got to this part of your back yet, but is it any different yet? It's a little bit better. Yeah, look at this, this is kind of interesting. So the right leg comes all the way up and touches the buttock. I can't even get the left one close. <laughs> do you see that? So the right. left one, is like five inches away okay. and the right one can touch. I, I do have to squeeze it forward, but I can't right. get this one to come down, uh -huh. right? And um, to do that correction, we usually have to check for sacrum laterality, where the sacrum moves from left to right or right to left. I'm trying to figure that out before I make a correction. So first I'm grabbing the tubercles and I'm driving the sacrum from left to right, and then I go back and see if it creates a stress pattern, and it doesn't. Then I pull it this way, and that made the leg go short. Yeah. So I'm gonna adjust from left to right on the sacrum. And I'm gonna get two spots, cause it feels pretty tight. I did three, not two. So legs are balanced. They come up even, they both touch. Look at how they both touch. So see that with the video, I hope. And do you feel that? I do. So that's important. And especially as a dancer, you want right. your legs to, five inches different is a lot. You know, that's, that's mm -hmm. like a 30%, 40%. 
discrepancy from the left from the right. Like 3% is normal, 1% is normal, 5% is normal, but the amount that you had was not okay for right. a dancer. If you said your, your biggest thing that you do physically is program computers, it wouldn't matter. <laughs> but, but dancing is a dynamic athletic movement constantly and you need to be in every shape and every direction you know, over and over. Um, so let's bring the legs back up. Do you still cramp in here? Uh, slight, I mean, it's not up here. It's, it's I mean, I okay. guess I, I, it might just be left over from. Yes, yeah, so we have more to do now because we didn't even do the lumbars yet. So let's do the lumbars now. I was just curious if we did a little bit with the sacrum, a little bit with the ilium and the pelvis, if we'd see a difference. Now I'm gonna come in directly into L4. I'm up at L3 just there. Let's start to see if you see a change next. Oh yeah. Okay, so what's happening now? To describe it to us. Is it less pulling in here? Yeah, okay. um, I, I just don't feel like it is cramping like this as much. Good. So now lift this leg up again, because remember, keep it long like we did before. And remember you felt a crossover? Uh-huh, now so I just feel it on the right. Now you just feel it on the right, okay. And that might be appropriate because he needs some of those muscles to lift that leg. Do you, when you say I feel it on the right, does it feel wrong or does it just feel like it's no, athletically it's, active? Right, athletically active. Okay, now lift the left leg. And again, are you feeling like it wrong or do you feel like, no, like, feel like the right muscles the right are muscles. engaging and doing what muscles do? Mm -hmm. The right Good. muscles. Good, so let's now have you turn your face left and right. So go left first with your nose. Just sticking on the paper. Yeah, and lay your head down. And now turn all the way to the right. Is one way harder to turn? Or are they kind of even? Uh, turning to the left is harder. Point to the spot. Right here, and then there's, there is some on the other, the, on the right side too. Okay, so let's but. just do a little bit. Head face down. I'm gonna come in quickly and hit a few spots. So I'm gonna hit that one, I'm gonna hit that one, I'm gonna hit that one, and that one. So I went high, low on both sides. Mm -hmm. And now go left and right, and Tell me where we have to clean up. Where is there still stuff? I'm trying to figure it out. It's less though already, it's, right? It's a lot less. It's hard, hard to find out now. I think it's honestly fine. I think okay. that, that did it. All right, so that was kind of fun and quick, right? So now I'm gonna have you um, crawl to the top of the table. I'm gonna actually take the paper away for a minute. And um, I'm gonna lower the table so it's a good height that I can have some leverage. I'm gonna adjust into your upper back first. Okay. So take a big breath in and blow it out. Good. And big breath in and blow it out. How'd that feel? <laughs> good. <laughs> big breath in and blow it out. Good. I'm gonna just do kind of a side one here. I'm gonna just Ooh. hear one. Mm -hmm. Now lie on your back, please. Do you feel this in here where it's I do. tight? Yeah, it's tender. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Line your side facing me. I'll put a pillow under your head. Bend just the top knee. This one tucks like this. You're gonna move your hip closer to me. I like the way your shoulders are, so leave them there. Next side, come this, mm -hmm. this way. And come closer to me. This one, you yeah. feel it? No, but it was that, a was a deep, that was a deep one. <laughs> Come stand on this side of the table. Move around, see how you feel. A lot better. Yeah? Better. It's a couple inches taller. All right. <laughs> I worked a lot on getting that hip right mm -hmm. and getting the functionality of the lower hip, back. lower back, uh, and get that open and balanced. Mm -hmm. Thanks for awesome. coming in. Thank you. I appreciate Thank you. it.